The Jankery by J.M. Publishing. It beat a sunny-ass day, the sun beat smiling, and everyone was chuckling a good time. It was Sunday, April 1st, 1969. Everybody knew today was the jankery. Somebody's be scared and shit, so some people was hiding. Everyone was chuckling round with lil-ass kids throwing pebbles at each other and making jokes. Joe walked up to the podium and everyone gathered around him. Joe somersaults and shoe copped the box full of tiny ass paper slips and let out a loud chuckle. Morning, y'all, Joe hollered. Morning, Joe. The other villagers chuckled loudly. Some parents were battling world wars against their kids to make them sit still. Mr. Delagrew ain't making it, Joe quizzed. Thank he broke his ass, Joe, someone from the crowd hollered. Miss Delagrew said she gon' draw for her husband. Everyone looked at her kind of sus. Watson Brew drawing this year? Yeah, yeah, drawing for me and my mama, Bew Watson hollered. Glad she got a man to do it, someone else hollered. Ay, yeah, where the hell Tessu be? Tessu Hitchinhue was Bill Hitchinhue's wife, and she was late as hell. Wait for me, y'all, she hollered. Plum forgot what day it be'd. Everyone looked at her kind of sus. Nobody ever forgets the jankery. All these dumbass Yugans trying to get out of the jankery, Old Fart Walmart exclaimed. And they be saying up in New Chucklesburg they getting rid of the jankery. Damn fuels. Next they gonna get rid of farming. Damn. And now they got all these dumbasses like Joe up there janking on her body. Everyone knew Old Fart Walmart was pissed off. Like they be saying jankery in June, eating corn and shit real soon. Okay, y'all, let's get started because this story gonna be too damn long. Joe bellowed and began to call everyone up. Bachui! Harold Bachu walked up and copped a slip of paper. Yahweh! Chogley Yahweh chuckled up onto the podium and copped a slip of paper. Morning, Joe, he said. Couple people later, Walmart! Old Fart Walmart grumbled a cuss word and chuckled on the podium, copped a slip of paper, and got back in the crowd. K y'all, last person, Hitchinhue. Bill Hitchinhue got a paper, and then Joe exclaimed, K y'all, open your papers! Everyone opened their papers, and turns out Bill Hitch and Hugh got the one with the black rhombocosidodecahedron marked on it. Way to that shit ain't fair, Tessu hollered. You we ain't give him time to get the one he wanted. Everyone sighed and groaned and hollered loudly. We got kids and cousins. Make them take their chance. Fine, Joe hollered. Tessu felt bussin' now, but also real nervous. Kay, open your papers, Hitch and Hughes. Tessu opened her paper and almost died crying. Give me your paper, you dumb bitch, Bill hollered. He snatched it from Tessu and held it up like a fucking trophy. Tessu was crying. It ain't fair. Joe got off the podium and copped everyone's papers. K y'all, let's get this shit over with. Everyone grabbed their pebbles and launched them at Tessu. Everybody was going hog wild, and then Miss Delagrew runned up with a humongous big ass, massive ass stone. Hang on, y'all, I got me a big one, Miss Delagrew hollered as she threw a big-ass boulder at Tessu. Everyone leaped out of the way, and it hit Tessu plum in the forehead. She dead as hell. Jankery in June, eating corn and shit real soon, old fart Walmart cackled. Epilo. I, UA, I hope you liked my version of the story The Lottery by Shirley Jackson. This version is more bussiner in my professional book, Writing Opinion, so fuck you if you think this book is dookie. Like it? Buy it. K-Bye, John Tan. Jam. Maruba.